Have you ever wondered what the lowest paid jobs in the United States are? You might be surprised to find out that they're often the roles that keep our society running smoothly, and yet they're significantly undervalued in terms of financial compensation. In the year 2024, the lowest paid jobs are typically found in the hospitality and leisure industries. These include roles in restaurants, hotels, and recreational venues. They're usually entry-level positions that don't require extensive training or education, making them accessible for individuals looking to gain experience or earn extra income. While these roles are important, they often come with lower wages. The reason? A high number of people are capable of performing them. It's a simple matter of supply and demand, and unfortunately, it's the workers who bear the brunt of this economic reality. The median annual salary for the 10 lowest paid jobs is less than half of the national median salary. To put this into perspective, the national median salary stands at $59,540. That means these workers are earning significantly less than the average American. The disparity is stark, and it highlights the income inequality that is prevalent in our society. However, it's not all doom and gloom. There are ways for these workers to supplement their income. Some individuals may consider taking on a side hustle, while others might pursue additional training in a field they're interested in. This could potentially increase their earning potential in the future. To summarize, the lowest paid jobs in the United States are primarily found in the hospitality and leisure industries. Don't require extensive education or training. Pay less than half the national leading to a significant income disparity. However, there are opportunities for these individuals to increase their income through side hustle. This conversation is not just statistics. It's about the value of work and the people who do it, reflection of our priorities and values. And it's what we all should think about because in the end, everyone deserves to be paid a fair work.